Well, today we're hearing from the family of a Cogwit County man who police say was shot and killed by his wife's roommate in 2022. Caitlin Ireland has now been indicted on more charges in the death of Jason Chad McCollum. WALB News 10's Fallon Howard reports on the new developments in this case. It's been great. They've walked up to me, loved me, hugged me, condolenced with me, just you know, told me they're praying with me and that they're waiting for justice to be served also. The family of Jason Chad McCullum waited over a year to receive this update. Back in 2022, we reported that Caitlin Ireland initially was charged with four charges and then claimed self-defense. The charges against Caitlin Ireland have now increased from four charges to eight. One count for malice murder, one count for felony murder, three counts for possession of a firearm, and three counts of aggravated assault. Justice is coming. It's, it, the charges is a good thing. Um, we do hope that, you know, we um, don't have to go through the trial because we've already indulged in so much pain, but if we have to, we will. I spoke with Caitlin Ireland's attorney, Dustin Land, and he tells me that he plans to file a motion for immunity within the next 60 to 90 days. I also reached out to the DA for next steps in this case, but a statement has not yet been provided. The family plans on keeping Chad's legacy alive by wearing a t-shirt with his favorite phrase. It's a picture of my dad, and then on the back it says, I love you more, with his signature, because every time we said, I love you, he says, I love you more. Fallon Howard, WALB News 10, your hometown news source.